Hi everyone, welcome back to Shimania. This video is a little bit different today. I'm in Thailand and I'm visiting my relatives-in-law. Uh, you can see this is the house uh, behind me. This is their house. And what they do for a living, they are raising and breeding fish. And they have a little fish farm at the backyard over here. So today I want to give you a fish farm tour and show you around. So without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, we're gonna start with this pond. And here we have a koi fish. A beautiful koi fish, different cars. And this side is a koi fish as well, yeah? Yeah. And here we have another koi fish. They have a very beautiful fins. Interesting fish here. Yeah? Here we have more koi fish hiding here. <laughs> Are they koi fish as well, this one? Yeah, but there's no many patterns. Oh yeah, that's a mix, mix pond with some koi fish as well. Some other fishes. Lots of guppies here. Lots of beautiful guppies, very little ones. I'm sure they're gonna grow up a little bit, yeah? And here we have uh, lots of goldfish. Goldfish, take a look at this goldfish here. Yeah, beautiful, huh? Many of them here in this pond. And here we have, what is this fish? Do you know? Is it for rosy? They call rosy. Rosy fish. In Thai, in Thai language, they call to rosy fish, but I'm not sure what these fish are. Uh, beautiful fish as well. Some guppies here, I think. Maybe not. Very active fish. We have some more gold fish here in this pond. That's catfish as well. Oh, big one. It's a big catfish here. Do you want me to catch? If you can, yeah. But for me. Oh, you catch the big no, one. No. Let's take a look at this one. <laughs> wow. I see a big catfish. I think we just eaten yesterday in the restaurant, yeah? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so this is also for food, yeah? Mm. It's not for aquariums. So this fish, unfortunately this fish is going to be eaten. And this one is uh, another kind of fish. Also don't have a clue what is this fish, but this is for food as well, right? Aquarium. Aquarium. Aquarium, oh sorry, aquarium. So this is for aquarium. Yeah. Let's check this big reservoir here. They have plenty of fish here. And this is for for food as well, this fish, right? The same size from before. Uh-huh. I see. It's little babies, eh? Mm -hmm. There's a lot of little babies here. So, uh, let's go to the next one. Also, some uh, little baby fish here, here in this reservoir. Not sure what they are. Some more fish here. More catfish. Very little catfish. Very little catfish. Small catfish is going to grow up soon. Small catfish. It's a catfish, but they call Russian fish. Okay. They go fast. fast Russian again. catfish. Another okay. Oh, you make it more boring. Do you want to see what's going on? Ow! They bite me! Oh my god. I do it again, okay? They bite a little Just bit. Just a little? Yeah. Ow! Can you do it? Yeah. Okay. Show me how they bite you. Oh yeah, they bite, yeah? yeah. Look at this. They it's bite your fingers. <laughs> It's, wow, but it's, it's a very good feeling. Mm. Yeah, it's a very good feeling. You like like you touch all the fish. Oh, ow! <laughs> like scratching your fingers. Very good feeling. And this one is uh, very active. Very active. Look at this. They're happy. They want. They, they think we're gonna feed them, huh? Mm -hmm. Ow! 
Ow! <laughs> no. There's a lot of fish here. Ow! <laughs> so this is for food, yeah? This fish for food, I'm afraid. Whoa! Whoa! So next I decided to spend a few hours with Uncle Ne, he is the owner of that fish farm and he took me to another farm, that's right he actually has another farm and it's deep in the jungle, so he has to move some of his fish from one farm to another, just a normal daily routine for Thai fish farmer. So the farm in the jungle is like a storage farm where he keeps a lot of fish so the fish can grow up here and then he sells this fish in his main farm by his house. So now he is catching some fish and the way he does it is quite interesting. Instead of netting out the fish he applies a clever way, he simply drains the fish through the net, that's it. <laughs> I find it looks satisfying when you see the fish going through that small hole and appearing inside the net in another end. He netted a few ponds full of fish then put the fish in a big plastic tank and tied them up to his truck. Because Uncle Ned doesn't speak very good English, we had a little problem to communicate with each other. He definitely likes to talk and he always trying to tell me something. I wish I could speak Thai. Big spider. Perfect. Perfect. Work. 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 <laughs> hard work, huh? Fish farm is hard work. Oh, no hard work. No hard work, no? Easy. <laughs> Let's go. Once we went back to the farm at the back of his house, Ness started to move the fish to the ponds. He also sorts the fish by the size by getting it through the net with different hole sizes. This way he can sell different size of fish for different prices. Obviously the bigger fish normally cost more than the smaller fish. His customers are normally the owners of the restaurant who buy small fish because it's cheap and then they grow it to the bigger size at their own ponds. So the fish are sort of investments and the simple way to make some money is to buy a very small fish, raise it and sell it for a high price. As long as you manage to keep your fish alive and healthy, you'll get some profit at the end. Uncle Ne has two daughters, the youngest daughter Noon, and you saw her earlier, she kindly gave me a fish farm tour. And the older daughter Nancy, she's on your screen right now, they always help his father with his fish farm to move and sell the fish. This is kind of little family business they have here. So guys, this is, was a normal day for the fish farmers in Thailand and I'd like to say that was a fun for me to stay on this farm for a few days in this beautiful Thai province, Nakorn Si Tamarat. So I'm in the UK now, I'm in my back garden, it's a little bit chilly here today. Yesterday was 32 degrees Celsius, today is 19, so this is uh, how you kill, like, you know, all like that. So what I want to say, I was editing my video and I showed it to my wife and my wife said that I pronounced your uncle name incorrectly. His name is actually Uncle Ne, not Uncle Ne, so I apologize for that, hope it's okay. By the way guys, I have more footage for Uncle Ne farm and his passion is better fish and he keep a lot of better fish and the reason for that because he competed in the fish fighting. So they have a like a fish fighting tournament there. It's not completely legal, so it wasn't very easy to film that. And but I still have some footage from fish fighting. It was quite interesting event. So what Uncle Ney does, he is train his fish to be fit and strong to compete with another fish on tournament and then every weekend they have a, like a little tournaments where they bring their fish and they just this fish fight with with another fish and the winner got like money from that so you can bet money on the fish and i don't think guys you find this thing anywhere in the world i'm not sure about that so i have some footage of that and i hope you're gonna enjoy this and if you don't want to miss this video out don't forget to subscribe to my channel give it a like if you enjoy this video and thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one.